Nothing you can do but get back on the horse. Nothing you can do but get back on the horse. See if you can play better. I'm just gonna first pick a pounce here. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Schooner's good. I think the Stormfleet Aerialist is okay. But I think Pounce is just easily the best card here. Third best card of the pack? What did you think was the... What two cards were better than this? Did you guys know this is every turn? <laughs> uh, I mean, I do think it is the best card in the pack. A little bit awkward that it's off color from the pounce. Whiptail is a, just a fine creature. Bishop Soldier's a good bear. Jade Guardian's actually okay. The safe pick is the Whiptail. I think this card is just so powerful, though. Like, I think the upside is high enough to take this and not be sad that I'm losing a Whiptail. Yes, I learned today, after RTFC, that this triggers every turn if you have Raid enabled. Sirens look out easy. Nice, nice pickup. Had we taken the Grazing Whiptail, we'd still have some good green cards here, but I think Lookout's a bit better card than Whiptail anyways. We'll see if we end up splashing this still, but for now, this is a good start. You can't let it get you down, kids. You can't let it get you down. These things are going to happen, you know? Hmm. Not sure I want to take a Siren's Ruse here. There's another Deep Root Warrior. There's a Territorial Hammer Skull. I don't think my draft win rates were ever 80%. My sealed win rate was very high. We haven't done any of those today. I think this is the best standalone card in the pack. Hey, look. Four colors, four picks. The goblin is terrible. Woo! Woo! Okay. Okay, okay. All y'all, get back in the sideboard. We got a game plan. I wouldn't say I failed with Red White. I'd say my deck failed me. As have all my decks today. What the? Beep! Dude, this card's nutty. It's slow, but man. You know what? I'm, I wonder if I'm supposed to take the Fathom Fleet here. In all honesty. Ugh. I wonder if I'm supposed to ignore the 7 drop and just take the good 2 drop.
This card effect is obviously insane, but what if I go super aggro? I'm doing it. Eat me, chat. Eat me. We'll go rub and over Siren's Muse. Although we have mono pirates right now. But we can pick up the ruses later. You fool! Why do you think rummaging is so bad? I'm not sure why chat hates rummaging goblin. Bakaichi die! What's up, buddy? Welcome to the Num 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 Sub Club. Thank you for that Twitch Prime sub. Uh oh, I don't know if I have any chesties left. I don't know if I have any chesties left. Oh, I got one chesty left for my bestie. Thank you. You know how good rummaging would have been in a ton of my games today? It's obviously worse than a looter, but... I want this card to be good. I want this card to be good. I just don't think it is. But we're not running Shore Keeper. Sure Strike? Oh, Pirate's Cutlass. Pirate's Cutlass. Nice, nice, nice. You know what? I might just go with double cutlass here. Hey, I'll take a pirate. Sorry, Sirens Roos. I think there's still another one that can wheel, right? Or mono pirates and a goblin rogue. Yeah, there it is. Chat, don't get attached to this card. This is just bad, right? I guess with double cutlass, it's actually not terrible. All right, chat, fine. I'll take the wily goblin. I will admit it is better with two cutlass. Okay? Okay. It costs R R. Oh no. Oh no. It costs R R. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Uh, there's an unfriendly fire here, but just jamming the lightning strike. This Deadeye Tracker is just so good. Drover of the Mighty, also one of the better uncommons for sure. This deck is a thing of beauty, chat. Right now, it's a thing of beauty. We might be able to wheel the lookouts dispersal. I'm just gonna go with another Siren here. Sleek Schooner is okay. Buccaneers might even wheel. One with the wind probably wheels, as does Pirates. This is looking good chat <sighs> just breathe just breathe kenji it's gonna be okay it's gonna be okay it's gonna be okay Guaranteed victory. Guaranteed victory, chat. There we go. Perfect.
can't lose. I don't think I need three headstrong brutes. I think I'm taking the lookout's dispersal this time. Buccaneers here. Ooh, Pyromancer, get in. <laughs> Card is so good, what the hell? There's a Siren's Ruse. Pious Interdiction, Bishop Soldier, Jesus, the White. What do you mean? This is a one mana counter in our deck. Oh, wait, no, it's a two mana counter. I lied. <clears throat> we'll take the Dusk Legion. Turns our small, small Dirtles into 4 6 Vig later on. Yeah, I've been streaming for 10 hours today. Take the Aerialist. Yeah. Did I miss a sub? Ah, pro, pro. Thank you, buddy. Welcome to the num 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 no sub club with that Twitch Prime sub. One chesty on cue. No, I think dual shot is good if you have the uh, enrage enablers. Or not enablers, enrage creatures. I mean, I could just turn today into the first of our 12 hour streams. That sounds better to me. That way I don't have to do a 12-hour stream on Wednesday. <laughs> CC Catan! Hello, my friend. Welcome to the Dum 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 Sub Club. Appreciate that. Twitch Prime Sub. Oh, baby! We're, we're almost we're almost back to 900 subs, chat! Almost back to 900 subs! Remember, this month... All new subs are 50% off. That's like cutting it in half. Think about it. 50% off, chat. Also, Twitch Prime is free subs. Free subs. Is this not one of the 12-hour streams? It is now. It's a vamp is it a vampire ship? Maybe it is. Hurricane 063! Welcome to the Num 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 Club, my friend! Thank you so much. Appreciate that. What do I think about crew in Limited? What do you mean? Are you talking about vehicles in general? 50% off, 30% win rate. We got it. Scully SC, welcome to the Num 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 So Club, my friend. Thank you for that Twitch Promarino. Thank you, thank you. Oh, Vanquisher's Banner. I would love it. It costs five mana, though, right? Still a good card. Oi. Eh, just another Siren Lookout. Sorry, Plunder. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, God, I almost misclicked. Thankfully, the Siren Lookout was uh, highlighted there. Jesus. Did not mean to click that. MTGO Traders. This deck doesn't need to splash. It's too good. Toast Stampa. What's up, buddy? Welcome to the Num 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 Sub Club with that Twitch Prime Sub. I mean, these are two, three flyers. They already have evasion, plus I have double cutlass. It's not like I need this. It's 
Okay, now I'm not sure what I take here. I wouldn't mind having another top end creature. I think Depths of Desire is a good <clears throat> bouncy pouncy spell. I think Chart the Course is also great. It's probably Chart the Course. Draw two for two. Dece. Sculptor is also a really solid value here with some of my creatures. Aquimus! Four months resubscribing, thank you. Alright, I'll take the draw too. I load the cannons. R R R. Windstrider's okay. Pirates is okay, but we got that burn. Mm, pirates prize or bounce? I think I'm gonna go with the bounce here over the pirates uh, prize. We actually have a surprising amount of card draw in our deck given the <clears throat> multiple creatures that draw cards plus like the uh, all the explorer creatures. Yeah, this is looking like our best deck to date. I'm sure we will go 1-1 one, one and I will baby rage again, but sometimes these things happen. Sometimes these things happen. Kenji's pirate name is Namai. Man, we've been seeing a ton of good white cards, but we also just have a nutty red-blue deck, so can't be upset. WTF, mate! This is the one! For reals! This is the one! Sometimes you just know... Now get rid of the goblin. Yeah, it's starting to look like this might not be necessary. Also, Wily Goblin. I'm just taking the Fathom Fleet here. Storm Sculptor could be interesting, and Perilous Voyage is also fine, but I think we want just another solid two, because I don't actually have too many two drops, right? As far as creatures, we have Looter, Aerialist, Fathom Fleet. So we only have three two drop creatures. I can't check while I'm in the middle of a draft. I can check after the draft is finished. Cut them real good. Uh, not going to play any of these cards. Sure. God, I want to try this card so bad, but it's not castable. It's not castable. What the? How does this wheel? I'm not splashing it. I mean, I took it. The thing I'm upset about is that I'm lacking a little bit of creatures. I just don't know if this is worth it. It probably is. Got the Prosperous back too. I don't. We don't need the Prosperous. We don't have any merfolk. This is a pirate, right? Not a merfolk, yeah. I 
extra explore triggers. What? Yeah, I think that's true. I think we just want all of the two drop pirates that we can get. All right, I'm gonna get the Wily in there. I'm not sure if I should be running any of these Storm Sculptors. I think one could be correct. That's a Dece Curve, if I've ever seen one. Can probably cut out, like, Lookout's Dispersal. Or actually, I guess I don't need Siren's Ruse, do I? I'm running two Cutlass already. The question is, do I want to run three? I don't... I don't think so. We only have 14 creatures. What? No way I'm cutting Shard, of course. Alright, chat. If I can't win with this... You know, there's something wrong with me, then. I think we want more red here. We have a two double red drop on two. We have the fire breathers, double red card. We only ever need a single blue. Maybe swap uh, one with the wind for a creature. I mean, maybe, maybe the storm sculptor is better than the one with the wind. Isn't it better to run more land if I'm running a freaking mono loot deck? What does Unknown Shores do? This is just actively bad, right? Okay, I'll cut the one with the wind for the uh, one of the storm sculptors. I'm down with that. Ah, <sighs> ship it! Come on, R in Jesus! Come on, R in Jesus! Daddy Nummy just needs one trophy to feel a little bit better about himself today. Saskiltera! No! Don't even say, Ah, oh, why didn't you run 16 land? This wouldn't happen if you had 16 land. Don't even say that. That's not true. This is a keep. We have Charter Course and we have a Scry for a land. Uh. Chat, this deck looks so good. Please don't let it die. Red, white, no two drops? Oh my god, hold the baby. Mountain? <laughs> I think I found the card that I'm gonna discard. Wily Coyote. Whoa! Oh, it's it's gonna be dinosaurs for sure if they're running Naya. Deranged sheep, what's up, buddy? Welcome to the Num Num Dum Dum Sub Club. Thank you. Hey, 
I'm going to play the brute to start racing. Because if this just draws a land and I'm not able to threaten it, then I'm pretty far behind. <laughs> what are you wearing? <laughs> doing, doing pirates. Pirate sets. I thought x not out yet. It's out today, baby. Oh. <laughs> Hi. Happy x day. <laughs> You'll be happy to know I've only had it on for five minutes. Yeah, what? Nothing. Well, we're dead. I need to draw a mountain this turn. All right, all right, all right, all right. I guess I just give him the opportunity to block. Whew. Do I need to dress up as a dinosaur then? If only we had a dinosaur outfit. <laughs> I have a feeling we do somewhere. No. Oh. Ooh, fight, gain a life. Or gain two life, I guess. Value. Gonna lead with a siren here. Too much land, Toshi! What's the strongest color in its one? Whatever color I am not playing is the strongest color today. <laughs> I believe it. Uh, but for real though. I don't know. Tell me it's mono red. No. It's like green. Deep Root Warrior. I guess I just need to counter. I thought it was very obvious, or very obvious why I played that... Uh, Look out. <laughs> Vampires negative five? No. Vamps aren't that bad. Incoming five five trample haste. I think I have to trade here. No, I don't. No, I don't. I can take this. I can take this and then desire if whatever big drop they play. Okay, yeah, we can just bounce that. Five lightning strikes? What the hell? All right, they binned it. Hit him for seven here. They might chump with their archer this turn, and then we get to play out our looter now as well. We'll be chumping with our lookout this turn. They might not jump if they have one removal spell in their hand, though. Oh, that's not a good sign.
Double loot! Don't need that. Don't need that. Alright, let's hold a baby. <sighs> Dead to the 5-5 five, five Trampler, but if they have it in their hand, why didn't they cast it last turn? Not mean. Okay, what if I don't block and they just replay their 4 4 dude? Attack with all, I have lethal. I'm gonna take it, chat. Judgment, okay. Hold. Hold. Pass. Pass. Yes! Mm. Are you ready? Kids? I can't hear you. Oh, who lives in a pineapple under the sea? Not me. <laughs> How many drafts have we done? How many have we won? Uh, I've done like two drafts, and we won one of them. Yeah, pretty good. I'm not free for another two hours, baby. I can't show you the shirt. Okay, you can show me a shirt. It's really cool. <laughs> it says installing muscles, please wait. Damn, it's on that it's been on that page for months. Ha ha ha. <laughs> My inspiration. Two and explore for two. Good card. Okay, no more lands for a while. No more lands for a while. It'd be great. You can't handle the truth. The problem is, this just trades. <sighs> Playing both of these is not good. Like, running this out as a 1 2 is just admitting defeat. I don't mind trading this away here. We'll trade it away for the Deep Root Warrior. It's harder for us to deal with since it's a 3 3 on blocks. I mean, I have two pirate cutlasses. We just want two drop pirates to go two drop into three cutlass. Too many lands. Where are our looters?
Uh oh. Well, they found their third color. Not good, not good. Right, but I also don't want to run three equipment with 13 creatures or 14 creatures. Okay, that's fine. Definitely just saving the cannon. Yeah, they had white cards last game, too. They had that 3-3 three, three, explore for 5. Bare minimum. Damn, this dude's got... Treasure! <laughs> Incoming Brontodon. Looter! Looter! Eh, that's fine. We have three of those damn looters. Oh, they're gonna... So now I have to attack with my Wily Goblin. Value. Alright, I see you. Well, I didn't think I'd be getting to 7 mana with this deck, but apparently I was very wrong. Because we're supposed to be looting all the lands away. See? Like that. Um... Yeah, I guess I just don't even play the lands now. Yeah, that's what I was saying earlier today. I'm always going to forget. Or rather, always think that... Uh, did they just chain Emissary of Sunrise? <laughs> oh, they did. Yuck. Okay. That's an issue. Um, so... I guess we have to cannon one of the Emissaries. Oh, you have a... What? Oh, just another Trove. That's fine. The loot's going. They draw another 2-1 first striker with explore. Let's hope they don't hit the plus one plus one. Perfect, that's what we needed. We needed them to hit a land. I'm going to take another hit here for three if they attack. Perfect. And having two doesn't mean I have to attack with two creatures. It just means one creature has to attack. Looters be tootin'. Tootin' be fruitin'. I think I'm actually going to attack in now and clear their board. Trade off here. The 3-4 is really putting a damper in my attacks.
This is also better for my headstrong brute since it's a menace creature on the battlefield currently. Oh, well then, never mind. Beep boop. Let's get back to looting. Starve extinction. <laughs> Ravenous dagger tooth. You got it. Oh, they binned it. I'm going to attack them with all. The only good block they have is on the two one. They're taking nine damage. They bend the Ravenous, so they're drawing an unknown next turn. So if it's just a whiff, or even a creature, is not good enough, because I'm going to have any combination of Siren Lookout plus the other three creatures lethal. Doesn't Revel trigger on your upkeep, so that's irrelevant anyways. Okay, this is the one. This is the one. Shh, Nami, Nami, no, shh. Isn't it always correct to loot if you have at least one card in hand? But if I have no cards in hand, I don't think it does anything. Maybe the marginal value, sure. Oh baby, this just this just needs a three drop and we're golden. We're a golden gravy goose with a land. I hope tomorrow the lag's not there, because this is, again, super annoying. What's up, Ted Duardo? 47 months, buddy. Thank you so much. Everybody's got those warriors. Yeah, the lag's pretty annoying. It's bearable. But, not ideal. We might get out aggroed here. In fact, I, I think I'm gonna jam the siren and hope to hit. Well, we hit a land, but that means I can't block very well now. Especially if, oh, if they play a dino here, hit me for five. Gross. Gross, gross, gross. <sighs> okay, that was pretty good. I'm not going to attack here with my Siren Lookout. If they play a Dinosaur, I'm going to double block the Knight. We're going to be looting away these Brutes, most likely. Aye. Booking here. Okay, they hit a land. Yep, just gonna be trading here. Before they can get a dino. Alright, land would be really solid here for us. Land, land, land. Land, land. 
Land. Suspense. Please. Land there, man, and we get to go Pyromancer, kill your 2-2, and then I can block the other 2-2. Oh my god, this lag is unreal! Did it just start when I got home? No, no, it's been all day. All day, too many people playing Magics. And the new set. What was that? Fire cannon. Sure. Alright, I'm at five. Land? Whoa! I think I still attack here. Oh, did he tweet that there are a record number of people online? That's pretty cool. The lag's more annoying to me than the losing is. That is a problem. Okay. Your chat's saying that you're lying to me about your draft score. I did. That's impossible. We've done like two drafts in 10 hours. That's how it works. <laughs> Come on, guys. We all know that. Chat, please. <laughs> Can I make you a beverage? No, I'm okay, thank you. I need to eat some food. I've only eaten a little bit today. Too much magic? Too much magic. None of the breaks. Thank you for today. No. How long does the draft take? Like an hour? I have to let that resolve. You've been streaming for like 10? Uh, drafts are variable in length. <laughs> I, think, I think I'm figuring this out now. Yeah, I'm just like, oh, I need to figure this out. God, they have that damn... Like, I need to save the counter for that 5-4 because the enrage kills me instantly. Oh, the fact that they could play two creatures here is so brutal. Well, I need to let it resolve and a land will work too. A land buys me a little bit of time. Because I can attack. Oh no, I can't attack because this is freaking reach. No, no, no. I, I still can attack. No. I attack here. I mean, there's a small chance they don't block. Like, this might be baiting. Damn, they blocked. <laughs> okay. Uh, 
Oh, this doesn't work because they play it post combat. Well, hopefully they punt. Yeah, we're very dead. Jeez. Star of Extinction. Still die. <sighs> what happened there? Was it we whiffed on lands a little bit too long? I think we're just running it back. It's true, we haven't drawn a cutlass. Turn two, pirate, turn three, cutlass, get him. Hey man, you know, based on today, I think the 1-1 police is completely fine. I'll take the 1-1 police over O2 nonsense, or O1 drop nonsense. Yeah, the, the other play I could have made was just to play out the Marauder instead of bouncing and going for the counter. We got punished because they were able to cast two spells the following turn. The one that I was holding up the counter. No, I think this card is stinky generally. It's just I have double cutlass and I needed more two drop pirates. I don't really think there's a better sideboard option. I couldn't counter the 6-drop. I didn't have... My last uh, pirate died. So it still cost the full 3. Poor Wily, so awkward. I think the ruse is okay. I can probably cut the Wily for the ruse if we go to a game three. Legit, I'm just going to run out the Stormfleet Aerialist. Stormcrow, baby. Right, but Nest Invader wasn't a pirate, was it? Hmm? Just getting more lands. Be aggressive. Be, be aggressive. Hey. <sighs> they don't have double red for their cannonade.
Four two, sure. See, I was supposed to draw a mountain there, so that I could go Wily Goblin in to look out. Alas, never lucky. Or just draw my four drop looters. Yeah, next turn if we have a mountain on top, we gotta go Siren Lookout into Wily. I'm actually really tempted to trade here. I think I'm going to. No savage stomps, no pounces, eating better creatures. Turns that off as well. I guess we'll top a fiver. <laughs> I've been only playing draft today, yeah. Although maybe I'm supposed to bottom. Now that I think about it, I'm supposed to bottom, aren't I? Well, that depends if they attack here, because we have them on a two-turn clock. But they might leave back two creatures to block the Brute. Oh, that's a good one for them to have, damn. Well, now I'm glad I kept it. Sorry, bin. When I say when I say bottom, I mean bin with exp explore. Might have bounce spell or something for that uh, grazing whiptail would be good. Hey, we found a use for our wily goblin again. That's also a pretty good draw. We finally found a cutlass. And it was as good as we expected. Yeah, the Brute uh, can secretly block as a Dreadnought. It can steer a ship, turns out. I think I block here. I'm not going to double block. I don't think that does too much, adding one extra power. Sure Strike is going to get me anyways. And most other pump spells, I don't play around by blocking with one extra power. Like if it's the plus three, plus three, etc. That, that, that works! I'll take it! Yeah, I'll cut Wily on the draw. 
I will try the ruse. The thing is, I need to go underneath them or get on the board faster. Which is why I need two drops so badly. Like, maybe I just run the frickin' 2-1. I think I have one Merfolk in the deck. The Storm Sculptor. Is it though? Is it 2-1 fine? Like, all of their creatures are X3s, basically. Yeah, maybe I'm supposed to cut the counter spell. And just run an extra bear. Alright, I'm fine with that. Well, I think Dispersal is better in this matchup than Cancel is. No, that's all right. Thank you, though. I don't care to eat in front of the comp. I don't care to eat in front of the computer. Chat doesn't want to hear me masticating. I don't... Uh-oh, opponent Mulligan and kept a one-lander chat. And that's the end of the OP. And that's the end of that game. Dude, string cheese is be is meant to be eaten like a stick. A stick. Oh, wait, 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 wait. They hit a land. They hit a land. Hold. F it, bro. Yeah, you pull it apart with your teeth when you stick the stick in your mouth. You know what? I'm going to show you how you eat string, quote-unquote, cheese. Man, that string cheese went fast. I'm actually going to discard the other looter here. This way I can guarantee play two creatures next turn or just the Pyromancer. What? I think that was the correct looter. 
That is a good sign if Buccaneers their best play. Woo! New game plan. Cannon their 3 3. LOL GG. Oh my god, this lag. Come on, click! Click, click, click! Click, click, boom! Click, click, boom! Alright, let's loot again. Discard the land. Let's loot again. Discard the land. Easy, baby. Dude, this deck is nice. Opponent has access to six mana. You opened three Marauding Looters and Storm Pirates. Nice, man. So they could have a pounce here. They definitely could have a pounce. So I guess the safe play is just to move the uh, Cutlass over to the looter since I drew a land here. Make all three of my creatures lethal. Oh, and you know what? I'm supposed to pump prior to attacks. Right? Wait, no. I pump once, now they pounce. And now I don't want to attack. I should have done this on my main phase. Mistake. Ah! I was supposed to do that on my main phase. I punted that. I'll just trade this for the Buccaneer. Right, if I attack with all three and they do have the pounce, which is what I assumed, then it doesn't work. I needed to have done that main phase and it would have. Or pump before moving the Cutlass, sure, yeah. I messed that up in a few ways. Wow, this is actually interesting. I think it's actually a Storm Sculptor, because with the cut list, the lookout's lethal still. I think that's way too slow is the only problem. But maybe I'm supposed... Yeah, that's tr that's true, that's true. Oh, you know what? The lookout's, the lookout's not lethal unless I hit the plus one plus one as well. Oh, yes it is, because I have the Pyromancer to finish it off. Well, hopefully they don't have a bomb dino to play. Okay, 4-4. Four, four. Topper.
Well, if, if we if we hit a land there, then I could attack with the lookout the next turn and. And uh, use the pyromancer to finish that finish off the reach creature. Right, but I know I'm drawing a two drop, and I have a five drop in my hand. That is a fatty. All right, so we make the safe play here. Just attack with both creatures. Pyromancer finish off the Dreadmaw. They'll chump the uh, lookout with their whip tail. And we'll play another 2-3 flyer. Uh, because it was a 6-4, so it just ends up trading with their 4-4. Four, four. Okay. 2-0. <laughs> it's so beautiful. <laughs> One more. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. We're making it happen. <laughs> I mean, two one's not bad. Two one is actually decent. The problem is <laughs> the rate. Before we get to that point, well, I don't want to talk about it, you know. I'm going to keep this hand. It doesn't have a 2-drop or a 3-drop, but this is definitely good enough to keep. Oh, I've played Sanderson millions of times. Good guy. For sure. I mean, I'm going to be doing another one regardless. I am now 11 hours into the stream. Oh my god, lag, please. We're probably just going to counter whatever they do here unless I can strike it. Alright, I think I like countering. Give me a clear board for the looter. Ah, yes, the whole raging runner. I dig it. They might have a pump spell if they're making this play, or they just don't have anything else to do. We'll get them with a lightning strike here if they do, though. Is this plus three, plus three? Trample? It is indeed, my friends. No crashing ramparts today. Thank you. Yeah, we'll chain lookouts, and we'll draw that lookout and discard our land. Absolutely. 
Why loot her before ship? This one costs one more mana, turns out. Whoa! Daddy's home! All right, let's race. Yeah, Monster Sword is the nut. <laughs> plays nonsense. Well, hitting a land here would be good and bad. Because I kind of want to not hit a land. But then if we do, I get to play out my other one. You know what, I'm actually going to leave back this 2-3 to crew if they don't have something here. Unfriendly fire, alright, deal. I'm going to block. Question is, do I want to block with the Siren and the Dreadnought? They wouldn't make this attack unless they had something, so I'm just going to throw the 4-6 in front. Oh! Oh wait, no punish, no punish, never mind. There's actually very large merit to not uh, attacking with the 1-2, because then I can't die to another unfriendly fire. Like, they have a pump spell there, then they attack for 6, unfriendly fire is exactly 10. And I still have lethal since I have the Pyromancer in hand, because I don't need to hit there for 5. Alright, this looks like a good matchup for Cancel. And probably the Siren's Ruse. We'll take out the Wily Goblin. And maybe take out one of the brutes. Goes down to 13 creatures. That seems fine. <sighs> I'm only one win away. Today has been pretty shitty day. Might just be charting a course, turn two. Yeah, this card's great. Alright, I, I lied. I want my Wily Goblin back. <laughs> Can I have my Wily Goblin back, please? Oh, Jesus. Oh. Okay. This is game two. We're up a game. Yeah, groovy.
Playing around it. Now I wish I had kept that Lookout's Dispersal instead. Oh, they have the 4-4 four, four flash? Oh. Didn't matter. If I counter that, they still just play their 5-5. Five, five. Jesus! Got spanked. Dude, we're doing 10 drafts after this one. Oh, come on! This deck mulligans well. <sighs> sure. You damn straight, I'm gonna play that out on turn two. This lag is pretty annoying, though. I don't know how much I want to play through it. We've already come this far. Green, black. Grim Captain's called mid-range. That card's an uncommon, so it's kind of hard to build around that particular card. Reveal the looter! Reveal a looter! Reveal a looter! <sighs> Sorry, cancel. Pretty glad I'm getting rid of that double blue card, though. I think I'm going to ru ruse my lookout. If I ruse the storm fleet, I only get to draw one card. This way I get at least another explorer. Well, I, rather, I get to explore and a card draw. They're both pirates. I guess a 2-3 does block that, but we know they have fat. All right. This is fine. Do it main phase in case I draw an island. We really need to draw... One of our looters here. I can't really race that, but we know they have nothing but huge fatties in their deck too. Okay, no plays is good. Would lo love to draw another lookout here. I'm not going to use it on their warrior. We have better targets.
Is it possible to splash the third color? Absolutely. Oh my god, this freaking <clears throat> lag. Dead Eye Tracker? That card's great. Didn't really matter what this was, I was just going to counter it. Alright, come on. Draw a looter, please. Or just a relevant spell, please. Charter Course would be also very good. This is how it ends, my friends. This is where the dinos take me to Brown Town. Start the client again, but this lag is so bad. All right, so they're just gonna do their four-four flash. All right, GG's. Damn. 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 If they have the four-four flash, that's game over for us. Ooh, they have nothing! Alright! Four cards in their hand, but still nothing? Hold the baby, maybe they're flooding out like we are. No plays again, okay, okay, okay. Come on, come on, spell, spell, spell. Spell, spell, spell. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Although, I have a very large feeling that this is just going to get unfriendly fired. No. I have a feeling this is going to get unfriendly fired. Because they haven't had a reason to use it on my looter yet. Uh, rather, on my lookout yet. They're not going to let me go to end step. Yep. Fire away. Damn. Okay. I still think we wait on this fire cannon blast. Holy mother of... Lag! Good news is, we still have two more looters in our deck. I think I'm just gonna play this and pass. Uh oh, that could be dangerous. And they haven't had much of a reason to use one of their pump spells yet, by the way. They whiffed? Oh my god, no land or dino. Nice! Nice! Hold! Hold the baby! Yes! <laughs> He's doing it! He's going the distance!
did it. It's so beautiful.